You can also change the sequence at the bottom of Object Properties. The software is set to auto by default in Object Properties, but you can also choose to start and to end to move selected items in sequence order. This can be used for embroidery designs when auto sequence is enabled. Let's say that you change the colors of some leaves in the design. And you want those leaves to embroider last. Without making a change in the sequence, the designs are going to stitch in the order that the software decides. And so the orange leaves are going to stitch at the same time that the green leaves will stitch. I can hold down the control key and select each of these orange leaves and then in object properties select to end. Now the orange leaves will stitch after the tree and after all the green leaves. So you can use this to rearrange parts of a design when auto sequence is enabled. When you change the order like this, the order of the other objects in the design will be decided by the software. You can resequence the objects of the designs by creating three groups. Those that will be embroidered first by using to start, those that will be embroidered in the middle, which will have auto, and those that will be embroidered at the end, which will be to end. If you do not make any change on the sequence option, Bernina Design Works will automatically create the best possible embroidery sequence for you based on the other settings that you have set in the optimizer options.